have a magnifying glass with me this morning. Do you know what a magnifying glass does? Well, if you look through it, it can make things appear larger and more clear. You can see things through it better. If you shine a light through it or let the sun shine through it, it can focus that light and make it burn brighter and hotter. In today's Bible story, we're going to hear Mary, soon to be the mother of Jesus, say that her soul magnifies the Lord. In other words, Mary is saying that she sees certain things about God very well. She sees things clearer. She understands things better about God. She then goes on to say what some of those things are that she is seeing more clearly. She says she sees the mercy and the strength that God offers. She says she sees how God lifts up those who, like herself, are feeling lowly. She says she sees how God fills those who are hungry with good things. And guess what? By sharing and saying these things that she sees about God, that she understands better, she's actually helping to magnify God for the rest of us. And she is not the only one who magnifies God for the rest of us. After Jesus is born and grows up, we see him do the same thing as his mom does in today's story. He speaks and acts in ways that help us better see who God is. We see more clearly who God is and what he wants. Well, as we listen to and read the stories of people who magnify God, like Jesus, his disciples, his mother Mary, his cousin John the Baptist, and so many others that teach us the stories of Jesus, then we are learning how to also better see who God is. And the better able we are to see God, the more we become like Mary in today's story. We too become magnifiers of God. And that's what God wants us to be, to be his messengers, to take his word to others and share it, to be his messengers that help others see him more clearly. Can we say a prayer? Dear God, thank you for Mary and Jesus and the many others who magnify your love, your mercy, and grace so that then we can go out and magnify your love, your mercy, and grace with others. In your most precious name we pray. Amen. Y'all have a great week, and I hope to see you soon.